You've invested in the hardware, so now you've got multiple servers to handle your terminal services sessions. Half your users connect to one, half to another, but one server tends to get a little more taxed for resources. What can you do? Load balancing comes to mind, right? In Windows 2008, you now have Terminal Services Session Broker. It's a reincarnation of Windows Server 2003's TS Session Directory. Your terminal server farm will allow disconnected users to reconnect. The Session Broker is a directory here, keeping track of session state, session ID, username, all the vital so the end user experience is seamless, just like we like it. Your employees can work from one PC or move around the enterprise and reconnect regardless of the situation. And here's the bonus. You used to need 2003 Enterprise. Now, even Windows 2008's Standard Edition provides this functionality. What else is new? Compatibility, that's what. And let's face it, most of us don't necessarily have pure Microsoft shops. You do get integrated load balancing out of the box with TS Session Broker, and it can replace Microsoft's network load balancing if you like, but you can also implement TS Session Broker with hardware load balancers and MSNLB if you like to do so. And finally, terminal server draining. That's right, much needed. You need to patch a server, replace some hardware, or take it offline for any reason. Draining, preventing new sessions, allows you to do that. This maintenance mode is a huge addition to the feature set of terminal services. Microsoft has finally made some critical enhancements to make this a more robust solution for the enterprise.